Hey, what's going on everybody? Scott Dog Gaming here. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we are back. We're playing some Football Manager 2016, our Sparta, Sparta Rotterdam game with Dave Sexton. Now, we are in some horrendous form, as you can see. Um, we are taking on the team in second place today. Um, and then we're up against failed massive rivals uh, who are in the league above us. So I'm suggesting this episode is not going to be a happy one um good lord and they want us to go in hard let's just let's just change this back to normal i think right here we go Here we go, boys. We're still playing our new formation, three at the back, two attacking um, wing backs, two defensive midfielders, um, and then sort of a two support strikers as such, or an attacking midfielder, a support striker, um, and a striker. And 20 minutes gone. We're at home. Nothing has happened. Free kick hits the wall. Ooh, and here they come. I think he was going to be offside, but uh, it's not ideal because there's now going to be space down the wing. We haven't got any centre-halves. Our two uh, starting centre-halves have both picked up injuries, so if we pick up another one, we're not going to be able to play this formation anyway because we're not going to have any players to, to play it. Um, there's our two midfielders on our wing-back and a midfielder being booked. Van Morsel, and the reason we're, we're form has dipped is no, nothing's happening. For, what the hell was that? Is happening for Van Morsel? Absolutely nothing. We don't look like creating anything with this with this current tactic either. We've gone back to our, our normal tactic in the hope that maybe that creates something. Is it going to cost us straight away? It looks like it might. It's a good save. We've got lucky. Good header clear. There's the ball to the back post. Keepers there. 20 minutes to go. Ten minutes to go. We since we've changed tactic, we haven't had the ball. They have. There's that ball in behind us. It's always on. Oh dear, Dogan's given that away. It's not good news that. Try to lay it off to the centre backs. Not sure that was the move. Sometimes you just got to put your foot through it and clear the ball. And this is going to be game over, I think. Another loss. Another game without a win. This is putting a serious dent in our playoff credentials. 30 seconds. We need to get the ball back now. We need to get the ball forward now. We need to score now. Oh, the ball's across the box. There's no one in there. Game over. Another disappointing result. 
And that leads us into the next game, which I'm petrified of. Okay. New record of losses, or without wins, sorry. Let's go with our record run of wins mid midway through the first half of the season. Okay. Three days or two days to go. And then we take on our main rivals. Feyenoord, right. Rising has played down our chances, which is the right thing to do. I mean, there's much point in us looking at the next round draw. Okay. Same back four in. We have no others. Okay, good luck everybody, you're going to need it. Good luck. Oh no, not already. Oh my god. That was a foul, thankfully. I thought that was an own, that was an own goal. Ten minutes gone. Not surprisingly, they have all of the ball. All of it, the post. Can we weather the storm? Uh, no. No, no, we can't. Dirk Kite pops up with a goal. Smashes it home. One nil down. If we can get through the first half at one nil, we've still got a little tiny sliver of hope. Five minutes to hold on. Maybe do slightly better than that. Van Morsel, he should have scored. Oh, Van Buren should have followed up and scored. That could be our chance down the drain.
I'm starting to get a bit of pressure. Oh, that's not ideal. We've won it back. Could have been a foul. Wasn't given. Van Morsel out to Van Buren. Brought across. We've scored. We are on terms. Van Morsel plays it out wide. Van Buren plays it across. And then I think the defender gets a touch putting it past the keeper. And we just tap it in. Straight after. Straight after the restart. Oh my lord. What the hell has just happened? We've just taken a lead. As I said, if we could get through the first half at 1-0, we had a chance at least of maybe forcing extra time, but that is spectacular. There's no way we can hold out, though. In fact, I think it's about to end now. Oh, what a ball that is. <laughs> what an absolute peach of a ball. Okay, 65 minutes gone. Claver's on, the youngster. He's done all right for us. He looked at fault a few times but um, some very tired players so probably going to need to make another change just here everyone's knackered stop telling us that Reisiger Extra time. This would be an incredible way to end our losing spree. I'm not sure I see it happening, but... Okay. Second half of extra time. Here it goes. So extra time was one of those where nobody wanted to lose. It's going to penalties. Okay, still haven't picked my penalty takers, so let's do the same. But I'm also missed the, the first one last time out. Okay, good luck everybody. Van Morsel, can he take a better penalty than last time? He's our best penalty taker, and he missed the last one. Oh, he squeezed it under the keeper's arm. Just about. They've got one as well. Dirk Coit doesn't tend to miss penalties. Um, we've missed though. Could this be the end of our little cup run? 2-1 down on penalties. 
Here comes Dogen. Oh, he's missed as well. This is it. They've scored. We need to score these next two and save theirs. I don't see it happening. We've scored one at least. If they score, they go through. Van Beek is scored. We're out of the cup. Disappointing, but you know what? It was good for us. It really was. Four to five weeks. That's a real kick in the balls, though. Okay. Let's call it the uh, end of the episode there. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button. Follow us on Twitter at Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.